So uh, I'm Maciej Malawski. I have a pleasure to welcome you to today's uh, SANO seminar. Uh, as I said before, uh, Marian Bubek is uh, coming a bit late today. Uh, so uh, I have a pleasure to introduce our speaker today. Uh, okay, uh, can you hear me by the way? <laughs> Yes, I hear you. <laughs> okay, uh, just to make sure that uh, I'm not uh, talking to the muted microphone. Okay, so our guest uh, speaker today is Professor Zbigniew Navrat, uh, who comes from the chair and department of biophysics, faculty of medical science in Zabrze, Medical University of Silesia, and also from Professor Zbigniew Raliga Foundation of Cardiac Surgery Development, Heart Prosthesis Institute, and International Society for Medical Robot Robotics, also in Zabrze, Poland. And uh, uh, Zabrze is a famous place uh, where the first successful heart uh, transplant in Poland hmm, it was uh, performed nearly 40 years ago uh, and uh, since then the development in uh, cardiac surgery including the artificial uh, heart and uh, uh, recently robotics and simulations are uh, actively developed uh, so Professor Zbigniew Navrat is part um, uh, of this uh, team uh, and uh, Last but not least, uh, he's also a member of our SANO International Scientific Committee. Uh, so uh, we thank you uh, very much for accepting the invitation to this seminar. And uh, today we are going to hear about everything that not only a surgeon but also a patient needs. So all these uh, recent developments in heart uh, surgery. Okay, uh, so Professor Navrat, uh, the whole Zoom is yours. <laughs> uh, <please> start. <laughs> thank, thank you for, 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 for introducing me. Uh, thank you for, for our invitation. Uh, it's an honor and also a pleasure to, 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 to show you a piece of our job. Uh, firstly, I want to, to invite you for, for a short uh, walk uh, in our laboratories. Uh, please start the, 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 the film because um, it is the foundation of cardiac surgery development uh, in Zabrze in 91 was uh, set up to, uh, and in this laboratory we uh, prepare all artificial organs connecting with the heart and also robots. Uh, you can see the part for the valve prepared for, for, for the valve and also polyurethane shaped um, uh, parts for, for, for artificial heart testing the valve for, 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 for valve and uh, this is the, the view for company preparing uh, the uh, elements from the polyurethane to, to, to us and uh, now we back to our laboratory simulation of uh, the flow inside the ventricular device and next view for preparing the um, uh, custom for, for, for uh, polyurethane uh, ventricular device in foundation uh, labs in Zabz. Uh, this is the partially automatic system uh, um, but uh, you can see the results, the ventricular device, uh, pneumatic system, a membrane blood, blood pump uh, with the um, polyurethane, uh, with the special kind of valve. Uh, the next uh, is the producer of, of, of uh, um, the, the new kind of uh, blood pump. Uh, uh, it is the turbine type of uh, blood pump, uh, implantable. Radiga Heart Rod name, uh, also the, the elements uh, prepared in foundation for support the um, patients uh, in the hospital. And now we, we um, change the term for, for robotics. So you can see one of our PhD students uh, and uh, currently one of uh, also director of our foundation, Lukasz Mucha, and next PhD students testing our, our, our robot. So Robin Hart name is uh, this, this, this robot, you can see the movement of uh, 
there is the little kind of joystick that is possible to move the, the tool inside uh, the, the body. Mm, Darius Krawczyk, name of my uh, colleague currently, you can see him. Um, the next uh, uh, picture from, from testing the, uh, the robots uh, on the special model of, uh, of, of the patients. Uh, and so you can see the patented by us or in good joystick for, for, um, for contact, uh, uh, for communication between the human uh, and the robots uh, for, for, for surgery. Uh, and a few pictures from our animal text, uh, te te tests. Uh, Michael Zimbala and Yasha uh, Shlivka to, to cardiac surgeon uh, performed the operation on the pig. Uh, it is the, the, the um, bypass surgery. Uh, currently, the robots uh, work on, on preparing this, uh, this uh, connection between the, the, the vessels inside the body. Uh, for, for preparing the artificial heart and, and uh, robots, we need uh, simulation modeling, uh, uh, but also this uh, simulation modeling we prepare for, for advisory system for, for um, surgeon, uh, especially for we are interested in the cardiac surgery, of course, that it is, you can see the valve uh, um, uh, inside uh, uh, the body and the uh, valve uh, inside uh, uh, testing uh, testing uh, system for test uh, the float condition. Uh, for, for planning system, we prepare the virtual operating room. Uh, and uh, next, uh, you can see the flow visualization for um, laser flow visualization for test uh, the ventricles. And conference uh, meetings, of course, it is important part of our job because we try to transfer this knowledge and information to the uh, to the um, uh, scientists uh, and also doctors. Uh, but one part of our job with a few thousand people uh, first time in the foundation uh, touch the, 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 the tissue and try to, to um, surgery uh, perform on the animal parts or uh, on the special stand. Uh, that is really our, our uh, surgical workshop uh, preparing a foundation each year. Uh, that, that no, several thousand young people uh, tested his possibility for, for, for using several tools from classic laparoscopic to, to robotics uh, for, for performing the su surgery. And that the activity of our foundation is also education as it was one of, one of important part of our job. Uh, okay. Uh, that now um, where we transfer to the to the presentation. Uh, uh, okay, that let's start for, for the classic uh, part of, of of my lecture. That uh, everything that a cardiac surgeon and the patients need uh, from the heart, artificial heart, from simulation to advisory systems, and from planning tools to surgery uh, tools. That is Robin Hart, a robot. Uh, we are in foundation of cardiac surgery development and, and, and who we are as a foundation. It is the uh, NGO organization. It is also SME. Uh, it is also an educational center and uh, owner of research in the center uh, and owner of two uh, small company. Intracord is, is, is connecting with artificial heart. Uh, currently work a uh, few, few um, ventricles device in, in Poland, Polish clinic that uh, they, they support the service for, 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 uh, for these uh, applications and Africa homograft, it is tissue bank uh, connecting with our uh, uh, experience for preparing the um, preservated human tissue uh, for, for help the patients who need it. Uh, let's start uh, with the doctor and his needs. Uh, this is Professor Zbigniew Fraliga. Uh, Professor Zbigniew Raliga performed uh, in Poland uh, in Zabrze first uh, successful heart transplantation. Uh, and we work uh, uh, between this, uh, this cardiac surgery on and, and uh, his uh, patients, uh, preparing the material and uh, tools important for support uh, the, the treatment method. Of course, the first was the heart. 
uh, and uh, we prepare the Polish ventricle acid device at Polish artificial heart. You can see the ventricle acid device. It is the membrane blood pump uh, connecting with the uh, body via uh, two, 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 two or four um, cannulas. Uh, uh, we that the blood from our uh, atrium goes to ventricle device and back to 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 uh, big vessels uh, aorta or uh, pulmonary artery it, it helps the patients for for the small patients we need the smaller uh, pump that that the 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 full um, sizes of the the blood pump uh, is prepared in 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 our artificial heart laboratory the first, pa first patients was in 93 uh, this ventricle as a device uh, uh, designed by me and, and my colleagues uh, in this time work uh, over 20 years uh, uh, in clinics without any problems. Um, uh, and the, 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 the shape is the same on the, the valve. We change from one disc to two disc uh, valve because of lack of the of the market. This first valve prepared for, for, for ventricle device. Uh, this patient uh, uh, was two times uh, ventricle device. First uh, was uh, Bernhardt and after two years he back to hospital uh, and we use the Polish ventricle device to support this patient. Unfortunately he died uh, during the, the next uh, um, uh, heart transplantation. The longest, uh, to currently, uh, if you look for our clinical um, expertise, that, that uh, uh, oh, about 400 patients uh, was uh, supported by, by this vertical as, as, as device, and the longest times was two, two years for one patient, and I think that we, uh, it was good design for, 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 for it. Uh, next uh, needs, uh, it is new tools. Uh, need to become a cardiac surgeon want to use the laparoscopic endoscopic tools uh, like another kind of surgeon for, for create minimum invasive condition uh, for, for perform the operations that, that is the reason that in 2000 uh, we start the Polish project uh, uh, Robin Hart. Uh, the design of these uh, robots we started from two to two, two, two sites uh, one of side city cities uh, cardiac surgeon because uh, it is the design of telemanipulator that operated one is the important part of the system uh, that we look uh, how the decision is made how the movement uh, is used for 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 for, for control the different kind of uh, uh, tools uh, we use several cameras analyze the, the, the film the movements etc etc for preparing the good uh, comfortable ergonomic place for job for this um, surgeon you can see Joanna Śliwka, it is one of my students, currently a very important, famous uh, cardiac surgeon working in Zabrze. Uh, from, from the other side, you can see the tools and uh, the, the, on the stick of the tools and, and tissue, we analyze the force and another kind of um, kinematic and dynamic um, uh, characteristic uh, for, for performed operation on different uh, parts of the, of the, of the body. Of course, from the, the ergonomy of, uh, of cooperation, uh, the robots uh, and uh, the um, surgeon um, uh, and the patients uh, near the tool, it is one of the important uh, parts of uh, our design. You can see the first of our Robin Hart uh, uh, prototype, probably the Robin Hart 1. Uh, uh, seven degree of freedom like Da Vinci. It is a 2003 when we start uh, uh, test is this, this robot. So it is uh, a robot for, for video assisting uh, only that you can see the video camera on the end of this of this robot, uh, uh, Robin Hart Jr. Uh, and uh, you can see the part of the robot because uh, be, because um, during the operation we change also the the the, uh, the tools. Uh, uh, we clean the camera, etc., etc. That the um, uh, the, the connection of this uh, of the system for, from the point of view the sterilization and also functionality during the operation is very very important. Uh, the the construction uh, is uh, is uh, like this. You can see that one point is is the same for uh, different kind of moving these these robots. Uh, the kinematic uh, is uh, the mechanic. Um, is, is like this for, for performing this kind of uh, functionality. Uh, of course, it is, it is the reason that we need the special kind of 
positioning the robot with the, uh, with the patients uh, before the operation. Uh, and you can see on the short movie uh, what is the, the possibility of moving the, the, the video, uh, operation, video um, arm uh, during the, the, the operations. Uh, this uh, robot assists uh, surgeon during typ typical endoscopic operation that we use the typical mechanical tools, but the robot uh, works as, as one assistant uh, keeping in hand um, the, 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 uh, the video camera for showing where we are and what we are doing. Uh, this robot was, uh, uh, the license of this robot was, was uh, sold to, to, sold to, 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 to uh, the Polish company, and we wait for, for the market uh, uh, application. Uh, this this robot. This is the biggest um, creating by by us robot, Robin Hart from MCC. Uh, this robot um, may be used for, for operation for the three persons working near the table, uh, two assistants, uh, the main surgeon, and also this uh, um, control the positioning of endoscope uh, camera. Uh, this robot was tested during uh, animal test uh, um, ten years ago. About ten years ago, uh, Telerobin, you can see in the, with the console. It is the the, the concept for, for robot uh, for telemanipulating that it was for for the test uh, the robots for tele uh, operations. Uh, tools. Tools is very important, of course, maybe because we try to prepare the mechanic job inside the body. Uh, and but uh, our idea, a new idea, was to prepare the, the tools that is possible to mount on think on the uh, on the end of the uh, robot arms and also in the special kind of of, of the hand handle uh, uh, for continued operation if the robot uh, will not uh, use uh, from the different point of uh, economy or. Uh, our, our strategy that operation. Uh, when you can see, when, when you see hear that, that the operation is made by the robot, that uh, in half the, 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 the situation um, is that they use also different kinds of tools during this operation. That you can see, this is the first example of the of the our Robin Hart Uni system. On the on the left, uh, you can see um, the 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 the, the uh, arm when the robot uh, uh, work, uh, and the, on the on the center, uh, you can see the one of the our concepts of our console. Uh, the same kind of uh, handle is used for for for. Uh, for um, uh, for uh, the the tools that is possible to disconnect the tools uh, uh, from from the from the robots and uh, finish the, uh, prepare the part operation using this uh, the same kind of uh, uh, tools uh, the same degree of freedom uh, moving the, the the using the micro joystick uh, form of the parts uh, of, of tools working in the body. Michael Zembala was on the, the picture. Uh, what is the future? What is what is our research currently connecting with the robots? Uh, first, of course, is the cover of the distance because it's the telemanipulator. You can see uh, more picture of uh, Jan Nashlivka uh, that uh, sitting in a foundation of cardiac surgery, surgery development in Zabrze, uh, moved the robots uh, 20 kilometers uh, uh, um, far in Katowice in laboratory. Uh, next, uh, our, our experience was uh, using Museum of, uh, of Coal Miner um, in Guida, minus 320 meters, and we moved the robots uh, inside this, um, this, uh, this uh, coal mine. Uh, for for precious uh, operation inside the body, we need the touch, we need the feeling. Uh, that is the reason that we uh, tried to prepare it. Uh, uh, it was uh, made during the, the uh, European project, project uh, when we cooperate uh, in this part with the physicist uh, from Hungarian Academy of Science, uh, uh, led by Peter Furious. Uh, they prepared the, the sensors uh, uh, for, for, for special for our tools. Uh, and it was possible to 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 to, to have two uh, sensors inside this grasper 
for, for, for connect with the tissue and also working as a doc uh, nose uh, for connecting with the tissue, uh, moving like, 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 like this. Uh, we, we developed the special kind of joystick for feeling this uh, and currently uh, this uh, uh, research is continuing. Uh, as you see uh, on this picture, we also prepared the special uh, the handle tools, um, uh, the manual operated, and it is also on monitor show what force uh, we uh, actuate uh, uh, inside the bag. Um, Stiff lop, uh, which is the next uh, pro European project, uh, in during this, this project, we prepared a, a soft. Uh, uh, soft, uh, if possible, for changing, uh, like snake, uh, like octopus, uh, tools for preparing the part of operation uh, using this kind of uh, mm, uh, design. How to do the surgery optimal for the given uh, given patients? Of course, uh, we need the special optimization, as uh, and the simulation modeling is the one of the uh, of the kind for preparing this. Uh, in our in our laboratory, we we, we use the real uh, modeling uh, using the physical uh, testing uh, model. But also, we prepare first in Poland virtual operating room. Uh, I was the first in Poland who built uh, the uh, the soft software for, for, for preparing it. Uh, uh, and uh, uh, it is imp important because if we use different uh, degree of freedom of the tools, we have different uh, that the. Um, uh, uh, different possibility for moving inside the body. Uh, that uh, uh, the, the, the part orientation localization in the body is very important when we inside these, these, these tools because it's create uh, the, the area possible to do uh, and the, the organ possible to, 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 to reach uh, using these um, uh, operations. Uh, it is the, the one of the picture for, for showing the planning of a mitral repair surgery uh, using uh, our own virtual operating uh, room. Uh, but that for support the, the, the patients, uh, we have the simulation of operation that it is uh, the answer for the question what will be the flow, the pressure, when the operation will be performed uh, in such methods. Uh, using the computer simulation and uh, physical modeling uh, also. Next uh, step for, for support the surgeon is the planning of operation using virtual operating room that you surgeon can sit uh, near the computer uh, and uh, uh, try to, 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 to prepare the plan for operation. And it is possible to transfer this plan uh, to, 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 the, uh, to the computer and, uh, computer controlling the, the, the robots. Uh, and for instance, in laboratory, it is possible to, 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 to start the, the orientation of the tools uh, in the, uh, directly uh, by, by, by planning method prepare. Uh, and training, uh, education, the virtual operating room is also used uh, and uh, testing system. But of course, uh, the several um, training uh, training uh, stands uh, for for um, compile different kind of tools uh, during the, the preparing the operations. Uh, but also for, for for training directly to do to the kind of operation when we when we prepare the the, the animal test that uh, a few weeks that the cardiac surgeon. Uh, train in, in, in our uh, foundations uh, on the tissue uh, from animal, etc. as the, the elements of the operation, operations. Let's uh, uh, for a few minutes go to the biocybernetics laboratory because uh, from the organization point of view, uh, Institute of Heart Processes uh, is uh, uh, connected to, uh, is, is um, uh, consists of uh, uh, three laboratories, by separating laboratories, it is this, this laboratory connecting with simulation, modeling, and robotics. Uh, in this uh, laboratory, design of uh, applying to, uh, electronic signal processing, uh, analyzing of medical data, developing of using computer tools uh, for, for healthcare applications, um, adapting modeling methods uh, for, for the developing expert system uh, is uh, performed. Uh, mechatronic and robotic system uh, from mechanical design, electronic design, uh, also 
benchmarking, testing, and really virtual simulators and training uh, systems. Uh, the cardiovascular uh, model kit is the, the most important part of the job of the team uh, led by Zbigniew Mawota. Uh, we have, of course, constructed by us uh, uh, testing stand by also using the, the software and uh, and uh, um, apparatus for, for, for flow uh, analyzing, etc., for, for performing it. Uh, that you can see a few pictures of, of, of the testers. Uh, uh, most of, the, uh, of this is connecting with the valve because uh, also Liga. I uh, have uh, dreams to prepare a um, Polish uh, special kind of valve, especially for mitral position. Uh, that you can see the flow visual laser for visualization system performed by Zbigniew Maota in our laboratory uh, and several, several tester for hydraulic uh, uh, modeling the test of the robots uh, starting from the um, from from the um, uh, qualification te test a few minutes after uh, preparing to this valve uh, by, by, by our colleagues in laboratory, we can test uh, the, the, the function uh, opening, closing, etc. Uh, in, in our trust. After a few minutes, uh, this valve goes to the, to the next uh, procedure, but we have the, the possibility for preparing the passport for the valve, uh, calculate the parameters, uh, and uh, uh, based on this, uh, uh, and uh, based on uh, um, histopathology and microbiology test, test of the tissue, because we use the natural tissue, human. Uh, the decision is made that this valve uh, it is possible to use some of human and new. Currently, we stop this project from the economic point of view, but uh, several years we we'll work on this on this valve. And you can see on the center uh, the long-term uh, uh, tests. Uh, uh, the longest uh, test was about ten years. Uh, it was the, uh, um, of course, the very very quick test uh, that that. Uh, for a few hundred uh, cycle per minute, that it is uh, several years uh, tested uh, of the valve in a few uh, years, a few, a few months, for instance. Not only got of cardiac surgical system, you can see the example of, of, of this uh, physical and mathematical modeling methods and vitro test use diagnostic uh, card, uh, and picture. Uh, from cardiovascular system, optimize the surgical operation and personalize the planning of the optimal treatment procedure, taking into account the current state of the patient is, is, is made in this laboratory. And also, uh, uh, we use the uh, um, 3D uh, heart models, especially for instance, if you actually perform the transplantation for very young, uh, small. Uh, um, children and that we prepare different sizes of the, of the heart for, for, uh, for planning the operation most uh, perfectly. Uh, and you can see the segmentations uh, and the results, uh, for instance, for the model of tetralogy, one of the uh, problems for, 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 for children. How to prepare the doctors for the implementation of innovation? Of course, the training uh, that you can see the, the our original uh, training system uh, performing the foundation for laparoscopy and mechatronic tools uh, test, uh, uh, and also more classic uh, for, for laparoscopy. If you need it, that we can prepare it for for, for you. Uh, and few picture from from our uh, workshop surgical workshop performing foundation. Uh, from the historical point of view, the, the most important uh, for, for existing and for start the, the work in, in Zabrze uh, on the cardiovascular uh, modeling simulation robots, uh, artificial heart, was the first successful heart transplantation made by Professor Liga team uh, in '85. Uh, for, for help the patients waiting for transplantation, uh, firstly, we use the uh, ventricular device and heart uh, from Brno and from uh, from Moscow, uh, currently this, uh, this, this uh, teams and this uh, center was closed. Uh, only in Poland uh, we prepared the Polish device. And in 1887, uh, the first trans transplantation, the Picard was implanted uh, by the team of Prosoliga. And in 1983, the first implantation called VED uh, by this team was, was prepared. Uh, also, we use uh, only one uh, PALT-EAG, uh, artificial heart for artificial heart, 
Uh, and in 2000, we start the Robin Hart project. You can see from a from picture of the place where we are, uh, Zabrze, Katowice, um, and uh, Zabrze Foundation. Uh, Zabrze Foundation was established in 1991 uh, uh, for, for the support, the development of Polish cardiac surgery and uh, producing the artificial heart, robotics, and uh, all these uh, important elements needs for, for patients. Uh, one of these, of course, is a biological uh, source, uh, that tissue engineering and biological heart metastasis program is also performed by the um, uh, bi bi bio bioengineering laboratory. Uh, artificial laboratory work on uh, artificial heart and several kinds of blood pumps. Uh, and robots and innovation tools for surgery, do also the simulation modeling is performed in biocybernetic laboratory. Uh, you can see a few pictures from foundation. It is the bioengineering laboratory, uh, biological uh, health laboratory. It is this, this uh, tissue bank where the, the tissue is is is, is uh, prepared for 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 research for for, for, for clinics. Uh, uh, histopathology, microbiology lab, uh, artificial heart lab, um, and. Uh, uh, Organ organization structure maybe is, is not not important, um, but uh, if you if you need uh, for cooperation uh, the center with, with uh, such uh, possibility, uh, that please uh, contact with me, uh, and it is possible to, uh, to to start maybe new project. On the end of my 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 lecture, I will uh, few idea show you. Uh, uh, of course, because we work, we work on the, the biological tissue, we have our condition uh, height uh, and, and also uh, for support this artificial heart, uh, all this uh, uh, vacuum and, and pressure uh, system for, for, for work uh, and for continue the work and test the, 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 the artificial heart in other kinds of blood. Uh, that you can see on the, on the one picture, uh, for our activity um, and, and for, for the memory, uh, uh, last uh, picture from uh, the um, job performing in Foundation of Cardiac Surgical Development uh, in Zabrze. And robots, tools. simulation modeling and uh, the summary of the surgeon support uh, system and education uh, the conference medical robotic conference the oldest conference for medical robots on the europe uh, i think uh, uh, and uh, invite you to explore uh, and to cooperation uh, if you want uh, but um, let's uh, on the end of my lecture look for the sano uh, and um, a few propositions for, 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 for a few ideas for uh, preparing using this uh, new kind of organization. First, human organome project, uh, the semi-artificial human model idea is such that uh, synergy of engineers and uh, physics, uh, theoretical and practical work needs to start organization of organome project, description of the semi-artificial human. Uh, comprehension of man organism model contain natural and artificial organs working uh, together. Uh, objective is such that we have the, the people with the artificial material, with the artificial uh, mechanism uh, organs, uh, and uh, let's look for this uh, for for this human for for this. Uh, um, uh, organism uh, like uh, uh, the, the hybrid organisms um, using the biological uh, and also artificial uh, uh, part. But after the success of human genome project and the uh, pretium and physium project, uh, I think that this is this time for start a new organism project um, that that uh, that's look for the for, for the patients uh, from this kind of uh, um, experience. Uh, goal, uh, of course, is to understand, to help, uh, because in medicine, two plus two is not uh, just four. When synergy, uh, it is all you need, but when conflict, uh, nothing. A uh, few pictures from uh, demonstrating the different artificial organs, uh, historical and actual, 
uh, for, for me memory that uh, that uh, um, it is it is important to analyze the organism using these uh, elements uh, for simulation modeling and, and trying to prepare any advisory system for for, for these kind of patients. Uh, evolution uh, because this uh, this this man with this. Uh, uh, artificial organ it is the, the next part of our evolution that I think that a new approach physio technological man uh, it is important because we don't know uh, what will be the results of this that um, uh, this new paradigm also health technology uh, it, it, it is uh, possible to, 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 to uh, look for the patients look for the body look for the organism for the functionality of the organism using uh, analyzing of the different part um, from this uh, um, uh, body is uh, is um, consist of that it is time for organism uh, this uh, this uh, this project will uh, i think that for Sano is is the ideal um, because it is connect the um, medical data analysis, big data, research and simulation, uh, personalized medicine, and also artificial organs, uh, mechanics, etc., etc. And I think that's ideal for, for the multidisciplinary team uh, connecting with the Sano uh, project. Second, um, my view, uh, ideas is uh, minimally invasive artificial uh, intelligence. Uh, uh, that is mean that that connection between the surgery and artificial uh, intelligence. The robot is not machines, but uh, uh, and IT devices that creates a great opportunity for integration and diagnostic system with the operator. As uh, uh, Richard Satava, the, the, the one of the pioneer of the robotics and, and innovation in surgery, the future of technology and medicine is not the blood and pulse, but uh, the bits and uh, bytes. Uh, that such surgery is a specific type of, of medical activity that uses directly physical methods uh, uh, for 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 for, um, uh, uh, for for the body uh, operation uh, uh, and uh, because artificial intelligence is part of the robotics uh, for, 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 uh, for, in my opinion that I think that it is possible to, to use it uh, and it's create a new possibility. Uh, because in the medicine, the possibility of direct proof is very rare that, uh, um, that we need the support uh, for, for decision uh, using the, the several uh, uh, possibility also the, for activity robots, but for decision uh, artificial uh, inter intelligence. Uh, however, uh, we assume that we would like to operate in the place where our intervention is necessary by the methods uh, that reduce the risk of damage to, to health tissue as much as possible. It means that the loss of the ability to freely view and touch uh, the tissue, uh, the inability to directly insert our hands in the place of uh, surgery, this is the current uh, minimal invasive surgery dilemma. Uh, is this beneficial for the patients? Uh, can the surgeon possibly do this? Uh, this is a challenge for creating new tools and both artificial intelligence and robots um, are one of them. Uh, the less uh, invasive the surgery, the less visual and sensory information we have, the more uh, the role of the artificial intelligence um, increase. Uh, and last of the last of idea is connecting with the hubs. Uh, uh, possibility for, for, for connecting few kinds of organization uh, because we, I, I am the, the responsible for, for the DG here, um, the healthcare uh, robotics uh, hub uh, in Poland that, that I think that this uh, cooperation between uh, this uh, organization SANO and, uh, and hubs uh, is one of the interesting points for, for, for start. Uh, this is because how to do it uh, better. Uh, but uh, on the end, I want to, 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 to explain that from my point of view, it is necessary to consider the robot as the elements of the future of the man, uh, dreams to for, for freedom, equality, and just governance. I'm not sure that men are from Mars, women are from Venus, but I'm sure that robots are from Earth. Uh, that let's do it better. Uh, few, 
the last uh, picture from foundation uh, and the team working here. Uh, thank you for the possibility for this presentation. I hope uh, that was interesting for someone here and now. Well, many thanks for for this kind uh, this great overview of your of activity of the uh, foundation.